There are so many ways that we can be involving students more and more in our public engagement activity. They already do loads of different activities, you know, volunteering in all sorts of different ways. But we're beginning to get um, in, engaging with communities accredited in courses, um, volunteering to be a more kind of strategic way that universities work. And there's so, you know, there's, there's so many thousands of students in every university, you know, the impact could be massive. It's sometimes hard to impress on students that they are citizens of the world, that they haven't taken three or four years out of their activities, part of the population to say we're no longer part of it. Students nowadays will have part-time jobs, many will have jobs that seem more than part-time, so they're playing an active part in communities. And we need to put value on that and make them understand that we really cherish it and recognise and reward it. And so some of the schemes that are in place across the UK, and certainly in my university, show that we do value it, that it carries with it, a, even if it's a certificate of achievement, that that's something that says, look, I'm engaged, I've made a difference, and it's valued. I think the key thing is that there's lots of different opportunities for different students at different stages of their travel through education. Postgraduate students, um, we have quite a lot of training courses for them um, that enable them to be able to engage with the public in a way which lets them explain what they're doing um, in a very understandable way. And then we would expect them to go and put that learning into practice either by doing events at the science festival or perhaps the book festival, um, going out and working with schools, a wide variety of things. I think we've got to move a bit beyond some of our current concepts of student engagement. The things that students do volunteering, community service, it's all wonderful. But I think let's look a bit more broadly around the world. There is service learning in the States where whole courses are tailored around a degree of community involvement in the teaching and learning. We can learn from that. Students should be doing the engagement with the community um, because when they actually finish their education, degree, masters, doctorate, whatever it is they're doing, they're going to have to go out into the real world. I think there's definitely a role for students in public engagement, partly as, as the student experience um, and getting the maximum value out of, of what they do, particularly in these current circumstances um, for students, but also because the students today are often going to be the researchers of tomorrow and engaging with them at that level I think is, is really important. Our vision for this kind of work at Queen's University certainly is that public engagement is embedded at all levels within the university. So the project that I manage, uh, we're working with students from second year, final year students. We're encouraging them and supporting them to work on real issues that have been generated by communities and to think about the impact of their studies and the impact of the work that they would be doing. What we hope then is that they will go forward and if they go into research careers, even as early stage researchers, they will be aware of impact and the importance of public engagement in their research. And if they decide to move further on to research careers, they will have these concepts and notions embedded from, from early stage.